strategic plan 2024 to 2027. Wonderful. North and the global south. And of course the global north is the richest. I don't want to say the global south is what, but the global north is the richest. Uh, we are here to support you. We are here to stand with you. You are a pillar to many of us while we are in Parliament of Kenya and even when we are in Yala. Use the members of Yala who have been here. We are clapping for the royal princess. Moja, Billy. Yellow friends of mine, they, they love to set me up at UDA events. <laughs> uh, no, nowadays I'm comfortable. <laughs> Congratulations for actually doing it. We're very proud of you and we'll support you all the way. Between women and matters of girls and children and forward thinking, Hakuna Siasa. Speaker of Yala will be in Nigeria very soon campaigning for BABA to be able to be the chairman of African Union Commission, and that is the president of the United States of Africa. And just as he deported us to Arusha, we'll also deport him to Addis Ababa. Now let us welcome Honorable Dr. Shiranda from Uganda, and is the chairman of Uganda Independent but he was actually contesting against Baba. I called him to Naro and we settled with him. He stepped down because of Baba. Thank you, Karibu. Proud initiative is a timely initiative that we commit to support. And right on the speaker, I pledge that once we get the house, we'll have a motion in recognition and appreciation of initiatives like this, so that we call upon all our honorable colleagues. I will spearhead a motion, and I'm sure that the chairperson of the Yala Youth Forum, the Honorable Maina, will second the motion, so that the Summit of Presidents as well picks an initiative in supporting Faradi Foundation, because it's a timely initiative that is helping us as a region to grow and have an empowered community and empowered women. It's within the treaty for the establishment of the East African community to empower women in terms of agenda, but also empower young people and the disadvantaged community. You have to remember that there are normally three affirmative action groups. I've heard you mentioning the youth, mentioning women, you have forgotten persons with disabilities. So I want to plead with you, Honorable Falahada, please, included in Falde Foundation, so that also persons with disabilities are remembered, they are empowered, because there is ability beyond disability. We are members of the East African Legislative Assembly. East African community have eight countries. It also have 350 million citizens. It have 1.4 billion acres of land 98% of it is arable land, either for agriculture, forestry, or livestock. We also have 6,500 kilometers of coastline. We also have the largest water tower in Africa, the Congo Belt. The second largest water tower in Africa is still within East Africa community, that is small forest. So therefore, these are markets bigger than that market of the United States of Africa, uh, America. It was a bigger market than uh, China. So at least we can be able to invest. We also have the biggest land, as I have told you, 1.4 billion acres of land. So let us all integrate by widening, deepening, and tightening our relationship. I was a member of parliament nominated to represent personal disability. I was the chairman, National Council for Personal Disability. So I can easily say 
my disability in your jembe ya kasi. Without my disability, mimi napoteza kazi. Sasa afadhali ni baki kwa sababu hata kama natembea pole pole na swak. Umeona nikitembea rivers kama gari? Hata mimi nikujipanga tu, pale ambao wewe unaenda na sali moja, mimi naanza two hours before you. And then tutafika at the same time. Niko hii maneno ni kujipanga tu ama namna gani eh SG Veronica in National Assembly so nomination again is Jakarta. Falahada, you are the best. We love you, we cherish you and we will support you. Uh, Joseph Ndakritimana, the speaker of East Africa Legislative Assembly. Get your foundation coming visible. Bring it in Arusha, bring it in EAC, so that everyone could know it. And uh, from here, it's good. You have started well. But you still have a long way to go. This foundation, we don't want it to be belonging to your village, to your community. No. It must be recognized by all Kenyans. It must be for all Kenyans. From Kenya, we want to see you in Kinshasa, in DRC, and from there, please, you go to Somalia, you go to Uganda, you go to Burundi, you go to Rwanda, you go to Tanzania, you go to South Sudan. And every year, you will be reporting to me, telling me, speaker, now, I have jumped in this country. If you fail, you pay fine. With these words, thank you, one people, one destiny. I have an announcement on behalf of IALA. The IALA have contributed 1.1 million. Strategic plan for Falde Foundation. There is the official launch of the strategic plan for Falde Foundation, ladies and gentlemen. Strategic plan 2024 to 2027. Wonderful. Wow. And I'll ask Moshmira Falden to walk inside our beautiful house to get those copies of the strategic plan and share them with her friends. We'll give to the chief guest, the chief guest. And also to the speaker, and another one. Please to hand them over. Wait, just go.